an alternative equivalent circuit model for the MOSFET also exists. It is known as the T model and we are going to now look at how it can be developed from the hybrid Pi model. Consider this hybrid Pi model here. It shows the three currents ID, IG and IS. We can add a second current source between drain and a new terminal X. Obviously, this does not change our circuit because Kirchhoff's current law is not broken. Moving on, we can join the gate terminal to terminal X because IG equals zero. Now, if we move the drain terminal upwards and replace the GMVGS by a resistance 1 over GM, we get the T equivalent circuit model. The process of converting the current source to a resistance is shown in blue. See the source absorption theorem in the instructor's notes below. This replacement is valid as long as this resistance draws the same current. This is proven by the value of IS at the bottom of your screen. This model shows that the resistance between gate and source looking into the source denoted by the green arrow is 1 over GM. However, the resistance between gate and source looking into the gate is infinite. These insights into the circuit make the T model very useful in certain applications. Now notice that we did not include the output resistance R0. If we are to do that, our circuit will look like this. Also, if in the T model, we replace the voltage controlled current source with a current controlled current source, it will look like this. Remember this model? It will prove very useful in later courses.